Hi, I'm Steve from Fast Water Heater Company. Today we're going to troubleshoot an electric water heater. The two most common features that can fail on an electric water heater are the heating elements or the thermostats. If you can determine which one isn't working, troubleshooting your water heater is simple. So the first step will be to shut off the power to the water heater. So you'll want to locate your circuit breaker box, open up the panel, and look for the breaker that says hot water heater, HWT, or tank and flip that to the off position. Once you shut off the power, you will return to the water heater and we will begin troubleshooting. The next step will be to remove the access panels on the front of the water heater to expose the elements and the thermostats. Then you will remove the insulation. Then you will remove the plastic cover covering the element and the thermostat. Then at this point, we will want to verify that the power is off. We can do that by using a simple volt stick that you can purchase at any hardware store. And when you touch the wire with the volt stick, if power is present, the stick will light up. As you can see, the stick has not lit up, so we know we now have no power and are safe to proceed. These are the, the two components in the upper part of the water heater. We have the upper thermostat and the upper element. At this point, we will remove the two wires attached to the upper element. Once we have the two wires removed, we can do a resistance check on the element. To do that, you will need a voltmeter. So what you'll need to do is take, you have two probes on your voltmeter, you'll want to touch one probe to one screw of the element and the other probe to the other screw. If the meter is measuring no resistance, the element is open and needs to be replaced. If the meter is uh, registering resistance, then the element is good. Once you have completed your test of the upper element, move down to the lower element and repeat the process. So the next test, we will be testing for grounded element. Now to do that, you will still be using your voltmeter set to ohms. But for this test, we will take one probe and touch one of the screw terminals of the water heater. The next probe will be grounded off, find a good steel portion on the inner side of the water heater. Touch your other probe on that. For this test, we should receive no resistance. As you can see, we are getting no resistance. If we were reading resistance, this would be a grounded element and would need to be replaced. In summary, to troubleshoot an electric water heater, you will need to first, turn off the breaker to the water heater. Second, remove the access covers. Third, test the elements to see if they are open or grounded. Fourth, test the upper thermostat high limit and the lower thermostat to determine the thermostats are functioning properly.